What? I want you to John Oliver. You were going to good on John Oliver? I want to ask John Oliver a question. Uh, John Oliver isn't here right now. Yeah, but you put me on hold, though, right? I want I want to ask an opinion on on, on the whole thing with the Israels and the uh, the uh, Palestinians because I know you're going to change your tune when he comes in the, in, into the. You mean change my tune? I don't change my fucking tune. What are you talking about? You, you're going to change your tune. You're going to, uh, when he tells you that Israel's at fault. He, 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 he can say that all he wants. I don't. He, that's his prerogative. But I'm not going to change my tune. Israel's at no fault. Israel is at fault, actually. Fuck off, Hansy, you <laughs> cock-sucking fuck. Now you're getting angry at a mentally ill person. So what? I can do that. <laughs> oh, Robin. Robin, you're mentally, you're mentally ill. What the fuck are you talking about? Get the fuck out of here. How would Zionists run Israel? Can oh, you, fuck you, off with your thing. You know what I mean? I don't want to hear any anti-Semitism today. Jews get enough shit all over the world. They get shit on all the time. No. Oh, and, and what, Jews are the indigenous people of that area. You, 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 I'm you sick of the bullshit. And the Arabs don't even want those Palestinians. Otherwise, they let them um, matriculate into their country. Nobody wants. Yes, whatever you call that. <laughs> How much anti-Muslim propaganda? Right, I got to. I got to get off the phone with you. You're I sickening. You sicken me. You're sicken me. I'm so tired of the bullshit. If you're anti-Israel, then you're anti-America. So the only democracy over there. It's the only friend we have. Who's willing to fight, stand up for what's right? Give me a fucking break. But to get angry at Hansy over it. Yeah, I lost my cool. He <laughs> <laughs> uh, got under my skin with that shit. I you gotta calm it. down and realize. I'm tired of it. I, I, I read this bullshit. The guy from Pink Floyd is a big yap. You ought to shut his mouth, too. Roger. We know Roger. I love Pink Floyd, but that's where it ends. He's all worried. They, they, people forget history. Uh, Jews were being executed and killed, and they went over to Israel, this little shithole, which was a desert, had nothing going on. And uh, Israel, believe it or not, that little country with nothing going on there. I mean, it's a desert. Nobody wanted this. It wasn't even a country. It was a desert. There, you know that the median income, I was reading in the post today, is and the uh, Palestinian median income is $2,000. But the Palestinians are mad at the Israelis. Instead of being mad at the fucking terrorists running their so-called country, who are raping the country, taking all the aid the United States actually gives to them, that, that, that they're not angry with. They're angry with Israel. They're in the same region, in the same exact spot, and, and their median income is $2,000, and the median income in Israel is $30,000, and... And they're mad at Israel for that. It's a miserable life to live in, in, in a Palestinian country. You're living there with a bunch... They elected terrorists to run their country. That's the difference. Now, who do you, who do you support? Get off your fucking high horse. It's ridiculous. Now, if, if the Jews could move to Mars, they would. <laughs> they get it. Nobody wants Jews. Nobody likes the Jews. We've heard it all. So much bullshit going down. And, uh, you know, and it's the same with black people. You got people in this country, uh, you know, you're screaming about the black people. Well, guess what? You brought the black people here. And you wrapped them up in chains, and, that, and that's why they're here. Now deal with it. That's it. Everybody doesn't want everybody else. Now, as far as I know, when, when it comes down to it, and, it, and one day it will come down to it, when Iran actually, when one of those Arab countries actually figures out how to work the weapons they have, because they love bombs that don't work, but when they actually figure it out, the only ally we will have in that region is the uh, Israeli army. That's it. And there will be a war, and there will, and, and it will come down to who's going to wipe who out, because that's where we're headed. That's why we have to, as Dr. Buzz Aldrin says, get off this planet and go to <laughs> go to a, a, a Mars, because people can't live together. Well, what are we going to do? We're all going to go to Mars and continue to fight, or are we going to send different people to different planets? I don't know. I, I think every person on this planet needs their own planet, <laughs> and they should just live there by themselves. That's how we will have yeah. peace. People are nuts. Let's just go around the universe destroying planets. Well, okay. Anyway, where were we? What was I talking about before Hansy upset me? <laughs> well, you just, you spoke to Hansy. I spoke to Hansy. You got me ticked off. <laughs> 
I don't know what would upset me more, that he thinks he's the ratings on the show or that uh, his views on Israel. What is, what is he?